Hey guys, Leif here from iTech. Today I'm going to show you how you can set up a one-touch scan destination for a uh, user box. So if you're using a user box as a shared folder on the network, which is uh, quite handy to do, I'm going to show you rather than scanning into the <coughs> user box, we're going to set up a scan one-touch. So the way we do that, we go to the address book and you can see I've already got some one-touch emails and so on. We're gonna create new. We're gonna select the address type. So rather than email, we're gonna select user box as the address type. We're gonna type in a name for the, so this will be the name of the button. Uh, I'm just gonna call, call it uh, folder. In this case, I'm gonna make it a favorite and down here where you've got the user box you can click on the uh, select button and you can select if you had many user boxes you would see them all here i've just got one in my case so i'm going to select that and register and now i'm going to show you how you can use this so we're just going to close out of there go back to the home screen and when i take my page to scan i'll put that in there and we're going to hit the scan button and you'll see a new uh, a new button on there called folder the one that i just created and it's uh, it's got the user box icon at the top so uh, select that and hit start this is an easier quicker way of scanning into the user box and just to show you how that works if i go into my in back into home and go into user box i can go in there and you can now see there's a few documents in there but the one i just scanned in is the one most recent one at the at the left there i could have also given it a meaningful name but that's it that's how we scan into the user box and then we can uh, browse that user box on the network just like a shared folder that's it